What is happening guys, how you doing? Welcome to my channel. It's your boy and I'm back again. This is my fifth take. Sometimes, you know, you get things almost perfect and you just say the wrong thing. And I'm a perfectionist, so I like to just get everything as perfect as possible. So anyways, long story short, we've got the Canada Goose and the Babe collaboration. And I'm going to show you guys in a couple of seconds, just, you know, uh, the interesting things that I've found. Bam, as you guys can see there, as you guys know, I do a lot of unboxing of very high-end jackets. So I know a few things about jackets. So you've got this kind of a Goose Parker jacket. I think that's called the Windham. The Windham jacket. So everything in terms of the materials is coming from Canada Goose. So you're going to get that top notch, you know, uh, jacket that's going to be, you know, uh, able to keep you warm in very cold weather. The only difference here is you're getting a sticker or embroidery on the left hand side, as well as the camouflage from Babe as well. It's subtle, but I think it's nice. I think with this kind of jacket, you can have it as your first kind of goose if you want to. But I think for me, um, because I am considering investing in a jacket from the, this brand, I would prefer, I think, to get a black or like a dark navy blue color, which is nice and subtle firstly. And then I might, you know, look at something like this as well. So I think if you own quite a few kind of goose jackets, this, this might definitely appeal to you. So if you're that person, I think it definitely works as well. So you've also got the the vest as well which comes in that camouflage as well and i do like those colors because you can you know um style your um outfit to incorporate any like neutral tone colors from different brands everyone is now making neutral tone colors as well so you won't struggle really to find an outfit for this as well and it's nice as well and it's warm and um, i think in regards to prices these are going to be at least quite expensive so i think with the vest it normally costs about 550 pounds um, so I think you might probably pay something similar. Same thing with the Parker jacket that I showed you before. I think that'll be probably um, a little bit just over a thousand pounds. To be honest, it's not really that bad as well. So you've got another vest as well, different camouflage. This one's got more green as well, and it's less deserty compared to the other one that I showed you before. Then you've also got the different Windham jacket. So again, with this one, you've got that kind of deserty it's not really desert as such but you know you get what i mean though it's a bit kind of like deserty esque um and i like it it's a winton parker jacket and i think i prefer this to the other one um certain people might not i think i guess gravitate towards this as it's a little bit busy but i think it's nice to have jackets that just have got that flair now and again it just kind of livens up the wardrobe a little bit so that's the inside of the jacket there. So you'll be able to verify that it's a Canada Goose jacket, first of all. And you can tell like it's got that very soft linen as well as the down in there. It's going to be able to keep you nice and warm. And also another thing which most knuckles don't do. Um, guys, I'm going to leave the link for my most knuckles jacket just down below. Because I think that definitely does compete with Canada Goose when it comes to, I guess, quality, aesthetics. You know, I think that just, yeah, they do compete against each other. So I leave the uh, link for that video just down below so you can go watch it before you buy that jacket as well. So I think what I don't have or what I'd prefer better yet with my most knuckles is having those two kind of diagonal straps so you can actually carry like your jacket like a backpack. I would really love that. So that's a nice thing. So also on the back of the vest, you've got that little thing there. I don't know. It's just like a, a patch, a massive patch there, which they've put on there. So yeah, I like it. It's not too, you know, out there. It's, you know, they've kept it, I think, as very close to what the both brands represent, I think, which is always hard sometimes. And so I think it's going to work. I think these will definitely sell out. So these are dropping, I believe, on December the 2nd. So they drop on Saturday. So yeah, get yourself some. Guys, thanks for watching. I think these are going to be available also in Canada Goose as well as the Babe Store as well. Peace out. God bless. Have a nice Christmas. See you guys.